And the first thing is this. Our Off the Top begins with James Cameron, who is talking about how he's still got at least six films in him before he's retiring. Right, this comes to us from the folks over at IndieWire. He plans to make at least five or six more movies, half being Avatar sequels. Now, we all knew he was going to be doing the Avatar thing for the, a long time, right? He's got a lot of those movies in him still, and those take a while, if Way of Water is any indication. Yeah, 13 years. Right? You know, just a tiny little film, a nice indie flick that he's just been working on, this lovely little auteur. Um, he said he would have to train somebody on how to do all of the things that he wants to do for Avatar, and no matter how smart you are as a director, he can't really do that. He can't pass on the reins. So when you hear this news about him still doing all these movies, Rob, what do you think? What does that make you feel? Well, you know, I think what I what I what we've seen is we've seen directors like Clint Eastwood. He's making movies at ninety. Mm -hmm. Ridley Scott is in his eighties. Scorsese's in his eighties. Well, just turned eighty. I don't think you have to stop until well you're gone. You know, and Ooh. and I like the fact I think creative people they don't just stop being creative. And in this day and age, it's nice to see people they don't have to end their lives like end their creative lives at some point and then they live for another 20 years without doing anything yeah it's a different time i i want to see more james cameron or i'd love to see more original movies from him too mm -hmm. not just the avatar films you're looking for more fresh ip from him. yeah unless avatar 2 is you know great but he's got a what i like about these avatar sequels is he has a plan he mm -hmm. worked with a writing a group of writers and they've done the work already so i'm 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 look i'm i'm deliriously excited to see this movie we're 15 days away yeah but, 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 here's here, here's the thing what yes. if i'm not doubting him what if just people don't watch avatar what if it doesn't make money what if it's a bad film do you think he'll still go by this i mean if no one sees this movie which i very much doubt then yeah i'm sure they'd put the kibosh on this but uh, like like the outcome is a disappointment to him do you think Ooh. he'll still stay on track to i think they'll at least make avatar 3 probably because they've shot some of it already oh, okay yeah john i want to kick it over to you i know you're a very big cameron fan what do you think of him saying he's probably going to retire around the ripe age of 89 is it the new 50 <laughs> does he have six more movies in him I, I, I'll be honest with you, I just like hearing a director not saying, well, I'm only going to do one more. I, I like hearing that, we've got six more films we're going to do. I like that. And it's really interesting, too, because when he's talking about um, Avatar, or like the possibility of Avatar 6 and 7, <laughs> he's like, well, I would have to train somebody to do that over the next couple of years, because no matter how smart you are, you're not smart enough to do this, which I thought was really interesting for him to say. No, again, I, I love the fact that he's not looking at the end of his career. He's looking at his future projects. James Cameron's a creator. And he I like what you said, Rob. Like, he should be looking at creating until he can't create no more. Right. And if he's looking at going to his 89, 95, whatever, if he's still got all his uh, faculties about him, go for it. I think this is great. Awesome. Well, guys, of course, we turn the question over to you. Do you think James Cameron making five, six more movies is a great plan? Do you think he needs to have Avatar be his swan song and be done? Let us know your thoughts in the comments down below. We want to thank a sponsor of today's episode, Stamps.com. Guys, it happens every holiday season. No matter how prepared we think we are for the season, it always turns out we're nowhere near as prepared as we thought we were, especially with our shipping. And right about now, seasonal excitement, or dread as the case may be, is really starting to settle in, especially for small businesses. Slaying through traffic to the post office? Inboxes more like a blizzard than a winter wonderland? Rushing to send cards and gifts to your loyal clients? The good news is it's not too late to get your holiday mailing and shipping under control with Stamps.com. Sign up now and you'll be printing your own postage in minutes. Because Stamps.com is your one-stop shop for all of your shipping and mailing needs. Get access to the United States Postal Service and UPS services that you need to run your business right from your computer. Up to 86% off. So this holiday season, trade late nights for silent nights and get started with Stamps.com today. Sign up with promo code Campia for a special offer that includes a four-week trial plus free postage and a free digital scale. No long-term commitments or contracts. Just go to stamps.com, click the microphone at the top of the page, and enter the code Campia.